Hey guys, what's going on? I got a really good one for you today. So all along I've been telling you not to do solar and I wanted to go back and tell you why. So I just watched, um, learned some information about a company that I've been following and I was disappointed on their progress. So I'm gonna have to take matters in my own hands and let me tell you what I'm gonna do. So I've got my two uh, solar trackers. If you follow the channels, Manny and Mo, and they're two individual arrays. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna combine these 12 panels in series and I want to generate approximately 400 volts output from these. And I always told people, don't do solar. If you do do solar, make sure it's high voltage solar. Let me show you what I'm going to do. I can't wait. I have to come up with my own way to do it. So here's one of my vans. And my mission is, is as you know, if you don't know, is to be 100% solar, 100% renewable energy to charge my five EVs. I'm waiting for 1,000 volt residential solar to come and be able to go into an MPPT charge controller and directly charge my vans. Well, I can't. So what I've done is I've got this DC fast charger and this DC fast charger is already set up, it takes 100 amps from my grid and it steps it up to 385 volts and feeds the van. Let me show you. So if I come here, I hit start. I can hear the vehicle communicating. This is going to start up. I just heard it click on. I'm going to show you the voltage this puts out. I'm going to put my meter on DC voltage. And my output, 384 volts. You see that? I got 384 volts coming out of this DC fast charger. I'm going to shut it off again because it makes a lot of noise. So this device is communicating with the car and it's opening up its DC bus. The vehicle knows I have a high speed DC fast charger, but the vehicle doesn't know where the DC comes from, does it? So what I'm gonna do is disconnect my wires right here. Here, Chris, come over here and take a look. I'm gonna put my direct output of my solar panels right to my DC bus. I'm gonna leave all the control pilot. Wow, that is warm. I'm gonna lose all, here's my, my um, plug present. My control pilot signals are here, and here's my DC output. I'm gonna disconnect that, and I'm gonna put my solar panels. I'm gonna to go to a 400 volt buff boost, so I can tweak the output down to 385 volts. And I'm gonna connect that output directly to the input to the car. So this device will communicate with the car, but it will take my DC instead of this wasted energy. So if you're interested in this, my name is Garrett Henderson, EV Charger Fast. Follow, like, subscribe. We're gonna find a way to jumpstart this industry and get us to the HVDC that we're destined to become. High voltage DC is a reality. It's happening all around the world. You better join up or you're gonna be left behind. My only tip for you right now, if you are considering solar, Stop, but if you can't stop and you want to waste your money, keep going, but make sure you use high voltage wire. That way you'll be able to do what I'm doing because the future isn't 150 volt solar, guys. The future is 1,000 volt solar. So, Garrett Henderson, I'll see you later. I'll do a follow-up video, let you know how my experience, my, my experiment went. But I can't wait anymore. I've been waiting for months, and now I have to come up with my own solution. And that's what I'm going to do. See ya.